Before I shampoo her hair, I like to brush it out first to get rid of any tangles. Did you know your body produces natural oils for your scalp? Brushing is a good way to distribute natural oils through the hair to the ends. Brushing also helps increase blood flow and transport oxygen and nutrients to the hair follicles, making the hair stronger, more resistant, and shinier. Before shampooing, I made sure to wet her hair and apply the towel underneath. Every strand needs to be soaking wet in order to get a deep clean. As I'm applying the shampoo, I'm strictly focusing on the scalp. She has thick hair, so for the next 3 minutes, I will be scraping her scalp in efforts to remove dirt, sebum, and build up that sticks inside. Now I'm going to rinse off the shampoo and move on to the next step. Yeah. As I lather her hair with the conditioner, I like to brush through it as I'm applying it. Now I'm going to rinse off the conditioner and move on to the last step. As I'm lathering the curl enhancing cream, it moisturizes while adding body to the hair. This product is meant to stay in your hair. Do not rinse it out. This smoothie helps hydrate and defines curls, helps reduce breakage, and leaves your hair amazingly shiny. Now I'm using a diffuser because I want to add volume and more body while maintaining her curls without any frizz. Last step, I'm scrunching some oil throughout her hair just to give it some extra shine. And we're done. Here's the final look. What an amazing difference. You can actually see her curl pattern. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Feel free to leave a comment below and thanks for watching.